Hey, what is up, Sag? I hope you guys are doing well. This is the Sagittarian Goddess. Thank y'all so much for joining me for another reading. I appreciate you guys so, so much. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into the tarot. And then we're going to clarify that energy with the Oracle. We're going to see what is coming out for you at this time, Sag. You got the Page of Wands in reverse flying out. Hmm. I feel like someone wants some type of second chance. Yeah, with the four of wands. Someone wants some type of second chance on uh, building something with you or creating some type of foundation or stable environment with you. This doesn't necessarily have to be a home. But with the four of wands, this could have a lot to do with a home environment, a family situation. This could be a Cancer, Aries. Hmm. But we're going to find out. Let's see what happens after the four of wands. I see some type of regret. Yeah, <laughs> you have the four of swords. I see some type of regret here with the, with the page of wands in reverse. Some type of regret involving a home. Maybe how someone treated you or, or treated your family or treated... Um, the environment that you shared with this person or the relationship that you shared with this person. I just see someone who's in deep regret about this and they've thought about this with the with the four of swords here. Yeah, you have the two of swords. It's like this person is wanting to make a decision, Sag. This person is wanting to make a decision. I'm not sure how you're going to react to this, but I do see the four of ones upright. So this could be something that you have also thought about. What happens after the Two of Swords? What happens after the Two of Swords? You got the high front. Hmm. Hmm. Why is the high front here? The Ace of Swords and the Two of Cups. Mm. So there is definitely um, a connection here that someone wants to make official. Someone wants to be more serious about here with the higher fund. But we want to pull some white cards and see where this energy is, is going. So you have this fire here. You have the page of wands with the four of wands. The page of wands in reverse with the four of wands upright. There was a home situation or relationship that someone realizes that they didn't handle properly. So we're going to see what this is referring to. Tell me more about the page of wands and the four of wands for Sage. Why is this here? Back at it. Hmm. It looks like someone has had, like, I don't know if someone got a taste of their own medicine in the situation or they just realized that something something wasn't what it, what it seemed. And I do feel like someone is wanting to double back. I feel like someone is wanting to revisit a situation to see if it could work out. And then you have these swords here. So this is a decision. This is air energy. So we're going to see what's going on here. And then we're going to clarify this energy as well, Sag. You have the four, four swords and the two of swords. You are, oh my goodness, you are not allowed. Mm, flying right out. Mm, I'm not sure. I feel like, Sagittarius, I feel like this, if this is someone that you given multiple chances to. I just don't I just don't see you allowing this person back into your energy, into your space, or to a certain point. Okay. It's like maybe you just want to be friends with this person, or maybe you just want to be acquaintances. But someone isn't allowed into something. And I feel like someone is devastated about that. Someone is devastated here with the four of swords. Someone is devastated about a decision they made. Someone realizes that a decision they made 
has created this this blockage between you and them. And it looks like the only thing that this person is thinking about is reconnecting with the higher front, the two of cups and the ace of swords. Um, but I do feel like there could possibly be someone new in the picture or there could just be someone better for you. And you could feel this. OK, if there is a connection or, or a romantic connection here uh, that you seek. And I do feel like a lot of you seek that here with the high fund, the two of cups and the ace of swords uh, for sure. I do feel like you feel like there's something better for you. If if a relation, if you're going to be in a relationship, you feel strongly that there is a better person for you. And it looks like you you could be willing to wait for that. Um, you could be willing to to wait and and really process things and understand things before you jump into a connection with the high front because you've learned a lot. So we're going to see what's going on here with the two of cups and the ace of swords. Why is the two of cups here? Why is the two of cups here for Sag? Validation. Even the score. Ooh. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Who I feel like uh Sagittarius. I feel like someone wants to get back at somebody here. Someone wants to get back at some someone for not validating their feelings. And I don't feel I feel at first this could have been a negative thing. This could have been like some fuck shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, you you're you gonna watch me be with somebody else, but now it's more so it's not it's not like a revenge thing. It's like this is a respect thing. Um I deserve validation. Okay? I I deserve I deserve this type of connection if this is what I seek. Okay? I don't have to settle. I don't have to settle for no bullshit. I don't have to settle for anything less than. And I feel like th this is the energy that this has sh has shifted to. OK, some type of energy has shifted because you do have even the score. So although this energy has shifted, this even the score energy, this is more so saying like, I don't I don't I don't have to deal with something that I don't want to deal with. I don't have to accept being treated a certain type of way. I deserve to have a fair partner, someone who validates me, someone who's patient, someone who's kind. OK, so you have the Ace of Swords. Let's see what's going on here with the Ace of Swords. Why is the Ace of Swords here? You have validation and even the score. Let's get a little bit more details on this situation. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Painful truth. Ooh. Hmm. So I, I see someone has faced a very painful truth regarding this situation, regarding validation, regarding being fair in a connection. I do feel like it's this person. This could be an air sign or a fire sign. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Wow. Someone realized that they didn't go about this connection with you properly. Someone realizes that they could have handled something better, some type of communication better. Someone is not fucking allowed into your space. And I feel like it's a respect thing. I don't feel like it's like this energy to where I don't know, like you would never. It's like, this is about my, my self-respect. This is about, this is about, okay, I don't have to allow you to treat me this way. It says you are not allowed. So I do feel like there's some type of boundary that has been put in place. Okay. So let's see what is going on with this painful truth. Why is the painful truth here? What is this painful truth regarding? Someone could have handled something better. Oh, look at that. The queen of cups. Someone didn't show that they were compassionate about how you felt. Someone didn't show that. They cared about emotions, okay? Someone has faced a painful truth. And I feel like this painful truth could also be something that you've also faced. You faced a painful truth about a connection and how you were treated. You you are no longer in denial about this. 
You got the Two of Pentacles. The Chariot. Ooh, and the Six of Pentacles. Yeah, someone is definitely thinking about uh, reconnecting with you. Someone doesn't know how to approach a situation anymore, okay? Someone knows better. Someone knows not to. <laughs> someone knows not to approach this situation because someone already knows that however they handled this situation, Sagittarius, it was not the best. And if they approach you, they, they're going to they're going to have to explain themselves. And I don't feel like this person is able or ready or even cares enough to explain themselves or even have the words, okay, to explain themselves. I feel like this is someone who doesn't have the words. Let's pull a relationship card for this. I feel like this is someone who doesn't have the words to explain themselves. They don't know how to word something. So this could be someone who you haven't been in contact with, Sag says let your friends help you ask for and accept support from others yeah i feel like this person needs help with explaining themselves or expressing themselves this could be you but i do feel like it's it's this person and i feel like this person doesn't have the words they they don't have the wisdom or if they do have the wisdom they don't they don't know what to do with with that wisdom they don't know how to 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 say it they don't know how to express it in a way that is going to come off as wisdom it, they'll probably sound ignorant okay if they try to come towards you because of how they treated you they don't they don't know they don't they don't know what to say behind that wow wow i want to know what's going on with this two of pentacles the chair and the six of pentacles pentacles because i see you moving forward definitely i see you moving forward while someone is looking back someone is thinking back they want to go they want to be back at something they want to get back to something what's happening here with the two of pentacles the chariot and the six of pentacles what happens after this the six of swords oh and the five of wands oh yeah you're done with it you're done with this sag you're done with this You've laid it to rest. Yeah, you didn't like how you were treated. You didn't like how you were treated, Sagittarius. But you're but you're not about to just be stuck on this shit, okay? You 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 no, you made up your mind. You're not about to be stuck on this. Mm -mm, nope. You're not about to be stuck on it. You have the five of wands. Yeah, it was conflict. Yeah, it was a problem. Yeah, you're wrong for that shit, but it's like, okay, I have other things to do. It's like I have other things to do. Like my health is important. It's so much. It's so. It's so many more important things than for me to be caught up on this situation. Because at the end of the day, Sagittarius. At the end of the day, with the Queen of Cups here, with this painful truth, you realize that although some shit wasn't wasn't aligned correctly, although things didn't happen in a respectful way, is what I'm getting. Something about respect here keeps coming up. Um, with the Queen of Cups, you realize that. Whatever this person decided to do, however they decided to handle you, ultimately, it had nothing to do with you. It had nothing to do with you personally, and it had everything to do with them. You could have sought out some type of validation from this person, okay? You could have wanted some type of communication with this person, but I do feel like there is something better for you, and I feel like you, you feel that too. You feel like there is something better for you. If you're already in a new connection, Sagittarius, this looks like it's going to be more healthy for you, okay? It's going to be better for you, for your mental, all of that. So let's go ahead and get a soul's journey. Tell me more about the Two of Cups and the Ace of Swords with the higher front. Perseverance and growth, yeah. I feel like this is going to be a, a healthier vibe for you a, a healthier connection for you uh Sagittarius it says I know that I I can do whatever I set my mind to and growth says I want to expand my consciousness and my awareness whoever this was in the past baby Sagittarius you weren't going to be able to grow the way that you wish to the way that you 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 long to you weren't going you you weren't going to be able to grow it was going to be a 
it was going to be a roadblock for you. It was going to slow things down for you. And I feel like you're at a at a phase in your life where you want to grow and you want to you want to expand, okay? You want to succeed in things. And with that being the energy that you carry, you got to understand that everyone and everything isn't going to align with it. OK, some shit going to have to move up out the way. OK, something didn't work out here because it didn't align with where you were headed. OK, with your energy. OK. So let's go ahead and get the overall, you guys. Yeah, the nine of swords yes so you could have fought off a temptation to reach back out to this person okay you could have <laughs> you could have really wanted to give this person another chance and you thought about it okay what are my values like what's going on here you have to check in with yourself and say okay hold up hold up this could have definitely been a, a air sign libra gemini aquarius Ooh, yeah you got death right after that. Yeah. You realize that this is something that needed to, to end. You realize that this was something that wasn't healthy for you. It it, it wasn't going to, it, it wasn't going to go where it needed to go and give what it needed to give. Okay. Uh, Sagittarius. So it looks like a lot of you have fought off a, a urge to reach back out to somebody, give somebody a second chance. And it's not that you don't believe in second chances. It's just that it's a respecting. It's like, okay, this is, this is what, how I know I want to be treated. This is, this is, this is how I know I showed up in this connection. I was, um, communicative about the situation here with the nine of swords and something wasn't balanced okay something wasn't even you have even the score and you're trying to grow okay you can't grow alongside someone that you're steadily trying to pour into and they're not moving okay they're not moving anywhere okay what's what happens after death the will of fortune look at that yeah oh a lot of y'all are realizing that now you didn't understand it quite then because it looks like you really wanted wanted something with the four ones you wanted you you thought about going back to something okay you something was very tempting okay something was very tempting and then you have all of these emotions involved so a lot of you have realized that now why you chose not to and a lot of you didn't understand when you were going back and forth. Okay, should I, should I not, should I, should I not? Why you were doing that? And now you realize after the fact, because something is about to be revealed. Something is hidden. Something was hidden from you. Something is happening behind the scenes, Sagittarius, regarding this other person, okay, that you did not see. What happens after the Wheel of Fortune? What happens after the Wheel of Fortune? Yeah, the Eight of Cups. You were going to be you're you were going to have to walk away from this person no matter what. Okay? There was going to be someone who who was going to be walking away no matter what. And then you have temperance. So it looks like it was going to be you, okay? At the bottom of the deck, Sagittarius, it was going to be you that was going to have to make this decision anyway. You were going to either have to make it then, okay? Or you're going to have to go through some more shit and then make it afterwards. So it looks like you made a choice based off of your intuition. Something was telling you, okay, uh Sagittarius, Look, you can either make this decision now or you can go through some more tests. Okay, you can go through the unknown here with Delphi and Will of Fortune, the Scorpio energy. This is something that's hidden from you, okay? There, there was something that was very hidden from you, Sagittarius, about this connection. And although this connection meant, it could have meant a whole lot to you, a whole lot to you, but there was some type of boundaries that needed to be put in place. Either way, you were going to have to walk away from this situation. And it looks like you chose to back up before things got worse or before something was revealed i have to i have to pull some cards okay and and see what's coming out here in the scorpio energy to see what were the things that were possibly hidden in this in the situation about this person because i mean i want to know i'm sure you want to know too i want to i want to know what is this dealing with okay what was this situation dealing with with death and the will of fortune? Because you're you're right here, Sagittarius. You you're gonna have to make a decision no matter what here with the two of swords. 
<laughs> you were going to have to make this decision no matter what. With the Eight of Cups. Wow, you were going to have to walk. Somebody was going to have to walk away no matter what. Hmm. Sink. Oh my goodness, look at this. Sink or swim. Ooh, wee. So this was a situation, Sagittarius, that that could have required you to make a, a a major life decision to sink or swim. Something could have something could have took you down in a connection, in a past connection. I have to I have to find out more. I have to I have to find out more. You guys, I have to find out more. Why is sink or swim here? Why is sink or swim here? What is this situation regarding? What is what does this have to deal with? With the death and the will of fortune. What does this have to do with Sag? A mature man. Mm. <laughs> oh my goodness. Listen, let me pull one more. Let me pull one more. Why is the mature man here? Great, great fortune. Oh my goodness. Ooh, wee, Sagittarius. So it looks like, like, like what's being hidden from you, Sagittarius, is like some type of fortune, some type of connection, possibly. Hmm. Why well, sink or swim here? With the mature man and great fortune. New love. I knew it. Oh, I knew it. 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 So it's um look, we, we all have choices. We we all have choices. It says a new person has stirred your romantic feelings. We all have choices. And like what's hidden from you, Sagittarius, is that it, it's just it's just something better. And I, I just know you feel it. I just know you you feel it or you felt it. Um and this would not have occurred if you would have chosen, okay, to spend your time and your energy with this person that has already shown you something that you already know that you, you didn't want to involve yourself in. It looks like you made the decision, Sage, and you felt what you needed to feel to remove yourself and to make that decision. And this was a very wise decision for you. Oh, wow. I want to know more about this new love before we end this reading. I, I have to know more about this new love. Why is this new love here? Why is this new? Oh. Oh. Why is this new love here? five of cups your heart has been broken enough it's been broken enough yeah you got the higher fun and justice your your heart has been broken enough and you know that like you it's, it's no more time to waste on things that you already know aren't isn't going to work out you you don't have time some of you could feel like you're running out of time like you don't have the time to spend any more like forcing someone to see your value or forcing someone to recognize something within you in order to show up a certain type of way. Nah, I feel like there's a new love here and it's going to be with somebody mature. It's going to be with someone who, who already knows better. Okay. Who already done been through certain situations and has evolved to a certain level. To the point where, okay, they know not to do this. They know what respect looks like. They know what a, a healthy relationship looks like. 
and this comes along with good fortune too like what the hell this this involves good fortune this involves good luck this this involves opportunities and it's new love hmm i want to pull some signs for this what signs could this new love be for sag Ooh, king of pentacles <laughs> be a Capricorn this new love could be involving a Capricorn see Taurus five of swords in reverse this could be an Aquarius the Emperor Aries Scorpio. Sagittarius. Aquarius. Let's go ahead and pull your angel number, Mr. Sag. Thank y'all so much for joining this reading. Make sure you like this video. Drop me a comment down below. And of course, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thank y'all so much. 12-12. I am focused. Stay focused on your best possible future and remain optimistic throughout the entire journey your angels are right behind you as you turn your dreams into reality i am focused and i do feel like this is why you made this decision because you were focused on the end result okay and not the potential of something but okay what do I need to consider? What do I need to do? What do I need to invest my time and energy into in order to reach this goal? Whether that be in a relationship or in a career idea. But with the Queen of Cups here with the painful truth, I feel like you realized, okay, it's certain things that I allow that I don't need to allow as I move forward. What happens after the Queen of Cups? What happens after the Queen of Cups with the painful truth? Two of Pentacles again. Ooh, the Ace of Cups. Ooh, and the Queen of Cups. Ooh, wee, yes. You realize what you need. You realize what you desire. And you, you're standing on that. You're not giving up on that. And that's very beautiful. You're willing to wait, okay? You're willing to get some type of balance within yourself while you wait you're full of love and whoever this person was in the past they they are definitely in regret be because of this because you had nothing but love to offer and that is a painful truth for for someone here in the past okay and i feel like someone could be feeling this they could even express this to you if not already one day so sagittarius thank y'all so much for joining me on this reading I hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys in the next reading.